Good morning, everyone. My name is Austin and Morrow, and I'm saying you can do much more. This morning, I would like us again to talk about how to recognize opportunity. Understanding that opportunity is everything, you need to learn how to recognize opportunity when you see them. And I want you to know that opportunities are everywhere. You come across opportunities every day and opportunity come across as you. You need to know how to recognize opportunity if you must so are I like a great entrepreneur. The other time we spoke about how to spot opportunity, how to recognize it because they are everywhere. How do you recognize opportunity? Let me start by saying, first of all, you must link yourself with creative mind. You must find creative minds as your friend. It is only when you have creative mind that you can be creative yourself. And I will always say, you cannot find what you are not looking for. Because it will come as a shock and you will not know that was what you actually need. So you need to focus your mind on recognizing opportunity by linking up with creative mind. And after you have linked up with creative mind, the number two thing you need to watch out for is you need to watch out for surprises. Surprises actually unveil to you what you have been looking for. Now, every surprise that jump on you, things that shock you, things that surprise you, in them are actually valuables that can become that big idea you are looking for. Now, if you find anything that surprises you, I, bet I challenge you to document it. And I also say document your challenges. Document what seems to be problems that you can see. There are a lot of problems on the street, problems of uh, waste, waste management, problems of uh, delay, uh, customer care, cost a lack of customer services. They are everywhere. All, every time you are disappointed, that is an issue. That is a problem that you can actually create a solution for. Document it. Then number three, you need to know how to document your solutions if you find one. Now, if, uh, if you are going to have what we call the Eureka moment, the moment of wow, the moment of a flash of a beautiful idea, you first of all need to start with documenting challenges. Because if you, if you, if you document your challenges, then you can think about how to provide a solution for that challenge, for that problem. Now, you will definitely have that inspiration on how to solve that problem if you keep that problem in mind. That, first of all, you need to document it. And each time you find a solution, you need to document your solution too. Document ideas that come to your mind, ideas that seems to provide a solution to something. It might be something as minute as helping somebody to catch a bus how to help elderly people to catch a bus, how to help children to catch a bus in our generation, even how to help school kids to get a bus quicker to school. It might be something as tiny as that. Now, that is how great ideas are better because they start with something small, something quite minute. I, I pick YouTube as an example. When YouTube came on board, there were other video letting sites everywhere. There were, there, 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 there were, there were Vimo and the rest of them. There were plenty, but YouTube kept up with easy access to downloading videos. You can download our videos, you can embed our videos into your site or whatever you want to do with the videos, you can do with the video. Now that is the little idea that gave them the edge. Everyone was doing the same thing, but somebody had one little tweak to that every uh, traffic idea that everyone was doing and somehow it changed the history of video lighting in the in the world so i'm going to tell you this that little idea you think is little that irrelevant a solution you think you can just uh, offer someone that is your big idea don't overlook it you need to document it somebody call himself an accidental millionaire or accidental uh celebrity today he found a tiny idea on how to help his friends go around their businesses, how to help his, his, his friends understand how businesses work and how they can market their business. And he thought it was just me helping my friend, me helping my neighbor. But somehow that little idea documented made him a millionaire today. And I can, I can give you countless examples of another lady who normally uh, dressed his own wardrobe tightly. And he found out that that little, little idea, what he call little idea, can actually make her an outstanding entrepreneur. 
because she documented it. Now we must start by documenting our ideas. If you must recognize opportunity, you must start by first link up with creative minds. The second, make sure that every surprise that come to you, you put it down. Then watch out for things that are challenged, that are problem. Document them as well. Then watch out for solution that your mind, are, your mind is going to bring to you, no matter how little they are. Also document them. And I will show you how to put the four of them together and get your ideas on the table and become that big shot that you want to be. I remain Austin tomorrow and I'm saying you can do much more.